health alert now. Scientists have found nicotine in cigarettes is as addictive as heroin and cocaine. But some pregnant mothers say one of the best motivators to kick the habit is the health of their babies. News 6 Morning Anchor Kirsten O'Connor shows us how a new program is helping families commit to quit. And tonight's getting results for your health. Holly and Johnny Gregory welcomed their second daughter, Root, in October of 2016, just as Hurricane Matthew was hitting the coast. So everybody was evacuating. It was wild. A yeah. stressful experience for any family, but Holly says her daughter couldn't have been born at a better time. Not six months earlier, Kristen Malkey helped start a new program in Volusia County, where the smoking rate among pregnant women is over 12%. That's double the state average. Um, I used to notice a lot that a lot of moms would get pregnant, quit smoking, and then they would start again right after the babies were born. And I always wondered, you know, why do they start again? They quit smoking and they did so well and then they would start again right after the baby was born. And of course it's because of the stress involved, but there really wasn't anything out there to help them through that. What's your sister's name? Um, Sister Root. When Holly and Johnny found out they were expecting their second child, they enrolled together, committed to quit and qualified for $50 worth of diapers a month until Baby Root's first birthday. And the vouchers really help a lot because there's a lot of expenses that come right away. When it comes down to it, that's, that's just, you know, I feel like I'm accountable. Kristen tells us Holly is one of 15 mothers who have quit smoking with the program. And Johnny is the first partner to join her. I think anything that's going to improve birth outcomes is getting results for the community because the health of a nation is um, measured on birth outcomes. So what better way to improve the health of our county than improved birth outcomes? So. How does it feel? Do you still have cravings? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Um, maybe that'll never go away. It's just something that you know that you can remember. but. But it feels so good to be quit. It's worth it. There is no cost to participate in the program, and participants are tested for carbon monoxide in their bloodstream to make sure they're not smoking. And because of its success, a second site recently opened in Edgewater. Uh -huh.